amount of energy in the room, obviously the amount of people here, it's a really good thing. Like in Cold Council, what, what is the deal and like why are you are here? It's like what is your really proposition sure. for Cold Council visitors? Yeah, that's a, that's a great question. Well, I mean, Protocol Labs, uh, we build uh, distributed and peer to peer applications, specifically at the protocol lab level, for data availability, right? So, uh, the primary way in which data is stored in the traditional web world is primarily using one of three uh, companies, Amazon Web Services, Microsoft and their Azure, uh, or with Google Cloud providers, right? Uh, and those are very centralized ways in which you can store data. However, uh, Protocol Labs, we really focus on building distributed and decentralized data storage systems. Uh, and so we are really here to talk about all the um, uh, great things that we have built to meet new companies and new teams and figure out if there's ways to collaborate and continue to catalyze this space of, uh, of web free next generation tools and, and, and protocols. Wonderful. So it's like Protocol Labs is a fully distributed uh, open source organization, right? And in other words, what is the Protocol Labs business like? Yeah, sure. So Protocol Labs was actually founded in 2014. Uh, our founder, Ron Benet, he's been working on IPFS, the Interplanetary File System, since far before that. Um, and uh, throughout the evolution of Protocol Labs, we have just worked on a whole suite of different tools. So Protocol Lab Tech Stack really starts at the base layer with the P2P, which we help maintain, then IPFS and IPLD. Uh, and then Filecoin as our primary uh, decentralized file storage system. And then even on top of that, notable uh, data utility and layer applications such as NFT storage, web free storage, estuary.tech that are really integral to all of these, um, uh, these web free products. Yeah, I mean, uh, customers span far and wide. Uh, everybody from individual developers that are looking to develop new applications to notable um, uh, protocols and marketplaces and existing apps, as well as a whole slew of you know, enterprise clients that also want to preserve, store, and preserve their data in a decentralized and a transparent and verifiable manner. Uh, and that is really the, one of the core features that we have developed and continue to build upon is uh, this notion of content addressing data. Uh, you can do so by cryptographic hashing that, cryptographically hashing that information so that you have a very robust end-to-end -end audit trail essentially of the state changes that occur to that data over time. And so, um, once again, uh, a, a tremendous amount of customers and ecosystems partners that we've been working with for a long time and hope to continue to do so out into the future. Great. And how do you describe your main goal for end of this year? Sure, well, uh, Protocol Labs uh, and Firefox Foundation have a tremendous amount of goals. Um, however, I work primarily on an initiative called File Point Green, and uh, our primary uh, goal for this year uh, is to connect the entire Filecoin network to renewable energy in record time. Uh, and we, uh, to date, we have um, uh, procured enough recs and deployed enough renewable energy to match to our middle line energy use estimate of the entire network. And by the end of next quarter, Q3 2022, we anticipate reaching that upper bound energy uh, estimate of the entire network. Therefore, the, uh, uh, we have you know, very strong confidence that by the end of Q3 2022, the entire Filecoin network will be connected to renewable energy.